Hello spooky friends and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. Last Friday, well yeah, last Friday, um, I came home to a very, very nice package from Bath & Body Works and that is what is right here next to me. It is massive. I can't pick it up and I can't take it upstairs so hopefully the lighting's okay and we are sitting down here on my living room floor and I'm going to show you guys what's in it. I have only gone through some of it. I tried really hard not to go through it because I kind of wanted to give you guys a first reaction. So if you're interested in seeing what I got, then just keep watching. Okay, so future me popping in here real quick because I'm editing this video and we're already at 30 minutes. So I just wanted to let you guys know, grab a drink, grab a snack, and let's unpack some stuff. Uh, I did want to film my initial first reaction, so there's a little bit of unpacking, there's a little bit of chit-chatting, <laughs> a little bit of laughing and dropping things, but I hope you guys truly enjoy this video, and I'm sorry that it's so long, but there's a lot of items to go through, and I was just really excited for some of them, so I hope you guys enjoy. So do you want to be clear that I did not buy anything that I'm about to show you? It was all gifted to me from Bath & Body Works and I don't have to be making any content, but I wanted to because if you've been around here long enough, you know how much I love my Bath & Body Works. They're some of my most favorite videos to film every autumn season and I haven't made it in this year yet because I've just been too busy and I still have some fall candles from last year so I don't need any yet, but I definitely will be picking up some just to make sure my stock doesn't dwindle too much when they're on sale again, but let's get into this box. Okay, so I figured we would start with the items that I have already unwrapped from Bubble Wrap because I couldn't contain myself, but I did stop. I only picked through like the top half and there's styrofoam, so I can't really see much else. But this little guy, oh, and it makes a sound. Okay, I didn't know it made a sound, but this little soap holder is so cute. Hopefully it's focusing on it. I have a hard, I can't tell but it's a little soap holder it's got skulls at the bottom and a spider on the top and it makes a sound but how do i oh that took me a minute to figure out how to turn it off but this little spider soap holder is 19.95 Moving on, and it has the same thing or feeling at least of this soap holder. This bottom part is like a rubber. This little like octopus kraken, this also is a soap holder. Does it make sound? This one lights up. Let me see if I can get it to light up. Oh, that's cool. I should probably put a soap in it. I'll show you guys with the soap in it, but it's all rubbery, the whole thing. And the front one has this cute little bat on it. This is adorable. I love that it lights up. Let me see. I don't think you guys can see. Oh, it turned off. Let me see. Can you see that? That looks really cool. I'll have to show you, I'll, I'll insert a clip. This looks really cool. I have to take it into the dark and do it. You guys won't be able to see it right now, but that's really cool. This little guy, same thing, 1995. Now, since I already grabbed it out, I will show you guys the soaps that they sent that were on top at least. So the ones that I've pulled out so far, I really love these foaming ones. The foaming ones are my favorite. I got the Perfect Pumpkin and Wicked Vanilla Woods. I am so excited that they brought this scent back this year. If I had to pick out of just the Halloween scents, which one was my favorite? It's Wicked Vanilla Woods, 100%. It's my favorite. So they did give me one of each of those. And then we also have Ghoul Friend, and it is the cleansing, it's the gel kind. The next thing that I unwrapped is their little spooky car wall plug-in. It's so cool and it is a projector as well. I'm really excited to try this one out. I loved last year's and it looks like this one has 
a purple background with some pink curtains whereas last year's was a green and purple I think I think it was um, I will insert a clip somewhere in this and show you guys what they look like lit up because they won't show anywhere in here if I were to take you I'd have to go upstairs now I do think the prices on these did go up from last year this is $39.95 which I also got the pumpkin from this year and this little guy is so cool I think he's so cute normally I'm not a purple fan but I think this one's gonna look really cool lit up there's no tag on it so I have no idea what it looks like but this one super cute the next thing I unwrapped was also a plug-in and it is the gold snake Trying to get it to focus for you guys, so sorry. There we go. It is the Gold Snake Wall Plugin, and this one is $16.95. The other things that were on top, of course, we have Vampire Blood. I really like the way that they did the cap this year. It looks kind of like a jewel, which is the theme that they have going on at the bottom. And we also have candy apple cauldron this i think is a new scent i am very interested oh that smells like some green apple goodness oh my god i love that so i love apple scents just as much as i love pumpkin and this doesn't smell too sweet i need to smell it again this smells so good it definitely smells like green apple they nailed it with this one Okay, so now I have not looked at anything else in this box. I'm just going to kind of dig around and grab something and show you guys. So if it's not in any order, I'm sorry, but I figured this would be more fun. <laughs> uh, the next thing I grabbed is a ghoul friend in the body wash. You know, girl, I almost said girlfriend. Ghoul friend really isn't one of my favorites. I just think it's so sweet. I think it's sweeter than vampire blood but it's really cute for your ghoul friends if you were to gift it. I think it's a cute little gift. Okay, this next thing is wrapped in plastic, so I will be right back. Oh my god, I know what this one is. I'm so excited for this one. I don't think... Oh my goodness, this thing is massive, but it's gorgeous. Oh my goodness, look at this look at all the detail this mansion i mean like compared to my hand it's big this thing is huge um i will say if your plugs are loose or you have older outlets like some of mine are i think original to the house because you don't really update those pretty often but some of mine are original to the house this will not this weight with an actual thing in it is not going to hold in most plugs so just be wary of that he does light up. I'll show you this, but again, I'll also enter a video of it. And this one is $42.95. If you can get past the price, I definitely think this one is worth it. This is so cool. This one, I, I oh, this is my favorite so far. Next, we have Girlfriend in the Foaming Soap. Honestly, you guys, I have so much soap now. I don't think I have to buy hand soap for probably two years. I have so much soap and I gifted some of my stuff last year to friends and family. So I have so much soap. All right, everything you keep pulling out is ghoul friend. I will say I do like the gem design that they did on the bottles this year and the caps. And I like the, I think they're called cameos, the little cameo that is on her. I think that's really cute. I like the design this year. We have Vampire Blood in the foam hand soap, and it may have been leaking because I feel like it's all over my hands now. Oh yeah, it was leaking. My hands smell like Vampire Blood. The next thing, I'm having a hard time getting stuff out of the box. Oh my god. Okay, okay. I'm making a mess too. Holy smokes, now I know why it was so heavy. I think this is another plug-in. Oh, this one's cute. 
It is the black cat. It has velvet on it. It's a nice little feel. This is so cute for all the little cat lovers out there. She's adorable. Seems to be a constant theme of $16.95 for the smaller type plugins. Now, I was trying to pull out this bag. I love this bag. Last year's was a little, I didn't understand the theme of last year's bag, but this is adorable. I love that it's got the house on it. It's got a house that I can't stop talking about and thinking about. <laughs> but let's see. So much styrofoam. I really hope that, oh, something is definitely leaking because that answers my question about this styrofoam though. I'm glad that this this is the styrofoam that, you know, melts down. Okay, I'll clean this up later because it's, oh yeah, it's lit. Oh yeah. Okay. Hopefully next year they package these a little better or find better packaging for it because this is meant to stay in its carton for you to refill your like soap and this has leaked everywhere. Like it's all over it. So just be warned if you buy this online, that might happen to you too. But I have the foaming, um, it's this. It's just the refill for this. Looks like we have a couple of the body lotions in here. We have Ghoul Friend, Vampire Blood, and Candy Apple Cauldron, which I think it's gonna be a new favorite of mine. And again, I love the design that they did on these this year and I love the black bottles. Sorry. Sorry. I love the design that they did this year and the black bottles, I think they're so cool. These are so slippery because they have vampire blood all over them. It's a good thing I don't hate the scent because it's everywhere. <laughs> These I loved last year. I love the Shimmer Fizz stuff from last year and it looks like they made them again this year. We have the Candy Apple and the Ghoul Friend. We also have a travel friendly Ghoul Friend here. Ooh. Oh yeah, I forgot that they did a men's collection this year. This is the Immortal Men's Collection. I'll have to give this to Randy. I don't know if he'll use it, but we can try. I am so thankful that this bath bomb is wrapped in plastic because we could have had a really bad nightmare, but we have the vampire blood bath bomb and then two more vampire blood goodies. It is the diamond shimmer and travel size vampire blood. And then we have a whole bag filled with vampire blood styrofoam that's half melted. At least this is the styrofoam that does melt down because there's so much in here okay it's we're on a roll with the vampire blood we have the other type of soap in vampire blood this one <laughs> it's the candy apple of all the green stuff is the candy apple one i definitely want to put this out now i think my soap at the kitchen sink is almost done i'm probably going to replace this soon okay the next is another wall plug and it is oh wow this is a lot prettier in person than I thought it was going to be. So this matches the candle holder that they had last year with the witch hands. I do believe that this is the only type of witch hands that they did this year. I think they got away from the hands and the bus. I don't think I saw <coughs> any of the bus this year either, but this one is really cool. I don't think it's going to pick up on camera right now but it's got like glitter over the globe and then we have a skull inside this is actually really cool and i love that the nails are black on this one this is really awesome this is 34.95 and it does project as well i'm gonna have so much fun plugging all these in okay this looks like a candle and it's pink so i'm guessing it's probably ghoul friend We have Ghoul Friend in the single wick candle. Again, I love the packaging. Even the lid is so cool. 
I think they really did good with the packaging. I was a little worried when I saw some of the sneak peeks, but everything that I've seen so far on the packaging, I love. So maybe it was just those few things that I was like, mm, I don't know. We have Vampire Blood in a single wick and the same type of lid on top with the three skulls and I don't know what you would call everything else on there. The squigglies. <laughs> okay, I guess all the candles are probably in one area because I keep reaching for the same area and it's another candle. <coughs> Oh my gosh, I am so excited because I don't think they made Wicked Vanilla Woods in a candle form yet. I think this is the first year that they have done this. Oh my god, I am so, so excited. I don't know how to describe this scent to you. I first heard of it from um, Jessica Pumpkin and Gray when it first came out and she said she loved it and I was like, you know what, that's a new one. I want to go smell it because I'm used to, you know, the vampire blood and the ghoul friend. Oh my gosh. But ever since she talked about it, I'm obsessed with it and now they made a candle of it. You could probably tell I'm very excited. We have the Candy Apple Cauldron in the Body Mist. Again, super awesome packaging. I love this. Okay, so the first three wick candle that I pulled out of this box is the Candy Apple Cauldron and the packaging, again, is just so on point. I love it, all the gems and everything, so cool. And this one does have the top where she's got like the crack and I think that's supposed to be like Medusa or something like it. Oh my God, it just smells so good. I don't know, something in this, in the candle form. I mean, maybe in the other forms of it too, but the candle is just, something in it is bringing me nostalgic vibes, which I don't think they've made this scent before, but it might just be the apple because I love leaves and the candle autumn which is actually on my table right now. <laughs> um, but the autumn candle has heavy notes of apple, so maybe that's where I'm getting it from. But since this one has the description on it, it is mysterious green apple, shimmering sugar, and crystallized bergamot. Oh, maybe it's the bergamot and the apple that I'm obsessed with. Okay, I'll stop smelling it because it just smells so good. I think we have another plug-in. How many plug-ins did they make this year? I feel like there's a lot of them. This one, ooh, this one is the octopus um, chandelier, I guess you could call it. It looks really cool. Not a fan of pink, but it looks cute. Excuse me, it's got like the eyeball in the top. This one does light up, but I wonder where it lights up. I don't really know, but super cute. This one is, oh, this one's $32.95. What I pulled out is the Candy Apple Cauldron Body Lotion. I feel like I'm literally just digging into the box now. We have Girlfriend in Body Lotion. All right. Oh no, this is covered in Hopefully you guys can't hear that. Randy's outside doing yard work and I think he has the blower out. So if you hear it, I'm sorry. This is really cool. It's one of their bags. This is $19.95 and it is one of their pouches and it's got a little strap right here on it. Let's see, what is inside? Holy smoly, there's a lot of stuff in here. I didn't think that they were gonna fill it. I thought that it was just gonna be styrofoam. So we have a bunch of the pocket backs, all the usual scents, vampire blood. I think I'm gonna stop showing the ghoul friend and the vampire blood because it's out here every year. It's the scent, you guys have seen the packaging, you guys know. So we're gonna skip over that, but we have all the pocket backs, even um, candy apple cauldron. I don't know why, that is a tongue twister for me now, all of a sudden. What else is in here? Ooh, this, oh my goodness, this is so pretty. 
I don't remember seeing this one. Oh my goodness, she is adorable. This is one of their scent holders and it's the new kind where it could be a vent or a visor, but this little butterfly, vampire butterfly, moth, whatever you wanna call it, is gorgeous. I hope the camera's picking up like the velvet underneath the wings. It's so pretty. I can't wait to put this in my car. There is no price tag on this one. We have a few more vent clips. This one looks similar to one of the ones from last year. I feel like this snake is kind of the same from last year. Um, last year's I think had roses and thorns on it, but it's kind of the same concept. We also have, oh, this one's really pretty. I like the blue on this one. It's like a gem kind of styled evil eye. Oh, and this one's so cute. And we also have the little skeleton with the swingy legs. This one is $12.95, so all of them are probably around there. This little one's adorable. Sorry, I'm like totally geeking out, guys, and I'm sitting on the floor. I cannot feel my leg, so I had to move for a minute. I think the rest of everything else that's in here is vampire blood or ghoul friends. Yeah, we have some... I'll be honest, I've never tried any of their lip glosses. I've tried the ones from way back in the day that don't look like this. I've tried those, but I've never tried the Vampire Blood. We also have our two original scents in Wallflowers and a car scent holder. Okay, so I know I said I was gonna stop showing Vampire Blood and Ghoul Friend in all the forms because you guys have already seen it, but this packaging on Vampire Blood on the body cream is actually really cool. It's got the gem look on it, but the haunted house that's in the back, it's so cool. So I just wanted to show you guys this. I won't show you any more vampire blood or girlfriend. Oh, this little backpack is so cute. It's a little mini backpack. Oh, that's adorable. And it goes in the dark. This backpack is $19.95 and so with these, I don't think, I don't think any of these, they normally only do it at Christmas time. Christmas time, the bones, at Christmas time, the pack, like the bags come with, um, what's it called? Like one line in it, like a gift. I don't think these come with anything in them, just FYI. I just think they used it for shipping purposes. Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to pull out of this little bag is this pocket back holder. If you are sensitive to flashy lights, just skip the next 10, 20 seconds, but this thing does flash and I'm going to turn it on if I can. It's so cool. It lights up. It flashes. So cool. This guy is $9.95 and might immediately go onto my bag. I hope it doesn't get dirty too easy, but so cool. The next thing that I'm gonna, okay. <laughs> I think this one will probably go on my bag. I have not seen this yet. I actually haven't seen the first two things that I showed you guys, the soap holders. I haven't seen those anywhere. But again, I haven't been into the store yet. This pocket back holder, so cool. It is the car. I don't think I've seen them do this before. That is really cool. And it doesn't, it lights up and makes a sound, but how do I turn it on is the question. Okay, that was cool. Does it make a different sound? Oh no, it honks though. It honks in the beginning. I don't think I heard that the first time. This guy is $14.95. I guess all the pocket backs are in the holders are in this bag because we got two more. Oh, I'm so excited. I really wanted the ghost and for some reason I can never find any of the ghost ones that they create. This guy is so cute. I can't wait to hang him on my bag. He's definitely the one that's going to be hung on my bag. This guy is $9.99 and he lights up too and he's got a little button. I don't think it flashes but be warned. 
Oh no, it's very faint. That's so cute. That that reminds me of like Tinkerbell's little dust. I love that. The next one is the little cat and it's really cute. She's got a cute little beaded collar on. So cute. And this cat is $7.95. It does not light up or make sound. So if you want one that just doesn't do that, this cat's a good one. Stuff. Yeah, the rest of this stuff is just some vampire blood travel size items. All right, the next is the Immortal Men's Body Care line. I want to know what this smells like. In my opinion, it smells kind of like vampire blood, but for men. It's got whatever the scent is that most men's... It says black plum, suede, saffron, and haunted woods. It actually smells pretty good. I don't know if I would use it, but it doesn't smell bad. I love the packaging though. Very plain, simple, to the point, perfect for men. <laughs> so I figured out why I can't lift this box. I think they have all the three wick candles in one corner and I just found them. The first up or second up because I already opened one of them. I also have pumpkin carving, which they make this scent every year and this was one of the things that was posted in a spoiler so you guys have probably seen this and it's got the same lid as the three small wicks do next up we have vampire blood okay i am struggling to get some of these candles out of this box okay oh we have two vampire bloods we have a normal one that matches the one that i just showed you and then we have this one that's got this super cool hefty lid on it this looks like it's cased in ice like this is ice over the top and then we have these cool spider webs on the edges this is actually really cool i love the packaging of this one I'll be honest, I have never burned vampire blood. I'm hoping it doesn't burn as sweet as it smells, but like this lid alone is so heavy. Is that glass? I think it's resin. Keeping on theme of candles, we have Ghoul Friend, which I think this packaging was also leaked. So you guys probably have already seen that one. This next one is so pretty oh my gosh <laughs> so when I grabbed it out I didn't I saw the top which is this snake I am NOT a fan of snakes but I can appreciate some minimal gold snakes I can appreciate and this is the wicked vanilla woods three wick look how gorgeous this is I have not seen this yet so this is a real first reaction Obviously I know what it smells like, but I wanted to smell it. And again, this lid is so heavy, but this snake on the front is just, this candle is gorgeous. It's simple, but I'm sorry. My dog is whining at the door. This candle is beautiful. I am obsessed with this candle. This one is $39.95. And just in case you are new to Wicked Vanilla Woods, it is magical vanilla glowing amber wood and enchanted pink pepper. So this one is a new scent to me. This is Spooktini. And this one was also one of the ones that was leaked, I think. Ooh, that smells interesting. What is it? Mystical berry potion, spectacular sponge sugar and spellbinding citrus. That is really different. I'm excited for this because I don't think I would have picked this one up myself. So I really wanna try this one. Ah, I'm struggling, I'm struggling. Okay, this next one I had to go get scissors for because it's covered in styrofoam. And I think I moved the camera, so I'm sorry if you guys are farther away, but I tripped and I stepped on the bubble wrapping. <laughs> it was just not pretty. Oh my God, this is so pretty. Ugh. 
I want to find a place for it now. Sorry, I'm struggling getting it out. Oh my goodness. She is gorgeous. I'm sorry about Bones whining in the background. I'm gonna turn it on. Where is your switch? There it is. Oh, look at that. Oh, sorry, let me put the eyeball to you. <laughs> look how cool that is. Oh, the eyeball moves, okay. I'm not losing my mind, I promise. This three wick candle holder is $69.95 and I'm trying to get the glitter off the side. This is absolutely gorgeous. Like this is worth every single penny, I think. Okay, this, this is a little too lifelike for me. This one kind of freaks me out. <laughs> This is, like I was saying, this guy is a little too realistic for me. He's kind of freaking me out. This looks real to me. <laughs> I don't know if I can use it, but it is still a three wick candle holder. I was a little confused for a minute, but that's actually pretty cool. It's a unique design and it's cool if you like snakes, but it's too real for me. This one is $29.95. That is gonna wrap up this massive Bath & Body Works haul. Again, thank you so much to Bath & Body Works for gifting me all these items. I am so set for the spooky season. If you guys have picked up anything, let me know what you grabbed and what you think of this line. Do you like the jeweled candles? Do you like the design that they did this year? I think they kind of did two different ones. I could be wrong though, I have no idea. I think I really like the, <coughs> all right you guys, that is going to wrap up this massive Bath & Body Works haul. Again, thank you so much to Bath & Body Works for gifting me all of these items. I am definitely set for spooky season. If you guys have bought anything or you've gone into the store, let me know what you guys think. Honestly, I think my absolute favorite thing to pick is still gonna be this house. This house is my favorite. I can't wait to plug it in. I hope that the plug that I wanna put it in is strong enough, but we'll see. All right, friends, I will catch you in the next video. Bye.